Here we have a SICK laser scanner. It's a safety scanner in a compact system that scans the surroundings and measures distances using the time of flight principle of measurement. First, our technician performs a visual inspection. Here, he finds the lens of the safety scanner to be scratched and damaged. We use OEM software to perform a functionality test to determine if the scanner is operating properly. Here, our technician will apply voltage and connect a cable to link the scanner and the computer to establish communication. Using the software, you can see on the screen that the scanner is setting off an erratic scan, giving a false echo. This means that there is nothing in front of the scanner, but it's giving a false reading that is detecting something. The false indicator is usually caused by a damaged lens or optical. First, we'll check the optical, the mirror and the motor rotation. The mirror must be clean and the motor must be clear of all debris. Everything inside checks out okay. Now, our technician will look into the scratch that was seen in the earlier visual inspection. We can see the lens is actually very scratched up and is probably the cause of our erratic scan. We'll get a new lens, put on and rerun our functionality test. Notice the major differences between the old lens and the new lens. Now he is rerunning the test scan. Watch as the pen is used to interfere with the scanner's echo. In the monitor, you can see that the pen we are using to interfere with the echo is being tracked by the software and is corresponding appropriately. Being careful to ensure that the reading is picking up and indicating an object at all angles is an important part of the test scanning. Notice the indicator light on the scanner is now green and the screen indicates a check. This confirms that we have no errors and our scanner is ready.